For anyone who's been living under a rock for the last couple of months, Gordon Bond is moving to Scotland. So this weekend we headed over to Airsoft Plantation in Essex to have one final game with Gordon before he moves up to Scotland to live the quieter life on a lovely bit of land where there might be a CQB site there. Now anybody that knows Gordon will know that he is the reason that a lot of people are playing Airsoft now. A lot of the people in Team Sasquatch, including myself who didn't even know that airsoft existed until i accidentally walked into battlezone airsoft in its original location looking for an air rifle and gordon took the time to explain the sport to me to explain me recommendations on where to start out and from there I was hooked. Gordon's been a big part of the Essex Airsoft scene not only in his shop but also out on the field guiding people and shooting a lot of people as well. He introduced us to the lovely sound of a Tipman, of which we demonstrated ably in a big bunker and deafened a marshal. Gordon and Battlezone Airsoft are also the sponsors of Team Sasquatch. It was a very proud moment for me as the former IC when Gordon made the decision to sponsor Team Sasquatch. This won't be the end of Battlezone. He will still continue to sell anything Airsoft related from his website. But what we're going to lose is the personal service that Gordon and provided the advice, the help, and fixing a lot of our guns repeatedly. So let's have a look at Gordon's very last game in Essex. I'm sure he'll be back at some point, and let's wish him the very, very best of luck. We've got Mr. Gordon Bond on tonight. <laughs> This is his last game in Essex, guys. He's moving up to the dark side. He's going to Scotland. Um, so today it's going to be really important. I pretty much started playing with Gordon. We played 10 years ago. We were playing in the woods, having great games. So it be really good today to make sure Gordon and his team have a super fantastic day. We have no arguing. Everyone has a good laugh. Uh, and then we can sort of send Gordon away, remembering how cool Airsoft is in Essex. And then when he gets up to Scotland, you can show them boys all out of play. All right, guys. Uh, first game we're going to do, because Gordon is here, what do you want to do first, Gordon? Attack or defend? Attack. Okay, red team, you're going to be the attacking team to start. Listen up, guys, because this is the important bit. Without knowing this, you don't know what you're doing out on the field. So, what we do? Right, in front of me are these two cases. In the two cases are two white smoke grenades and two pieces of paper. On each piece of paper is a location that you need to take that crate to, let off the white smoke to destroy that, that area, okay guys? Uh, Red Team, you will start on the border, you have got unlimited lives and you will have rolling respawn marshals, so in your shot, just head back the way the gameplay goes, find the marshal, give him a fist bump, puts you straight back in the firefight. Red Team, you need to fight your way into the village area and the suburbs area, Find the location of the two crates, collect them. Once you've collected your crate, open it up, find out what location is yours in your crate, then move that crate onto the location to destroy it. Nice and easy, guys. Very simple rules. Oh, I've got Game on! I'm really limited. Grab a time, Dan. Grab a time. <sighs> I can only assume there's a pub at the end of this, which is why Lee's running. At the end of the rainbow.
I've always said this is the best cure for a hangover for the week. Looks like I'll go with that one. Is that the second target? First one. He's still up ahead of the power. Now, go, go around. I don't know where we got a uh, John's just on the, just by the base thing. Yeah, straight through. He down. One behind the car's down, there's two behind the bus. Move in, eh? Uh, I have no idea, I would suggest that way. That's a job. Woo! Coming across, coming across, coming across. Sneaking through behind you. Yeah. Elegantly as a gazelle.
<laughs> yeah, it wasn't for a high five, sorry. <laughs> First to see where I am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> where is he? Yeah. 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 Yeah, very last minute thing, we only booked it on Thursday. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> no, just sat for a week, yeah. Have a bit of a break. Are you just going online now? You are, you? Just when we move, yeah, yeah. Guys! Over! How about another three to four weeks? We're going to play a very quick version of the D-Day game. We're going to turn it round after lunch. A very simple game. The attacking team has to fight their way out of the landing craft. down. That's it.
Goodbye. Well, that sounds good. Yeah. yeah. Oh, John. Well, right, exactly where you shoot in, just to the right. That's actually right. There's a group walking through, John. I was, yeah. was going to give them a chance to, you know, oh, get a few more them. bodies because I'm bored. Fuck them, it's Sunday. <laughs> They're all walking away. They're all dead. Well, make them more dead. Except for him. Not him, though. Yeah, that's the one I'm talking about. That sniper's only going to ling me into your shot. Uh, I'll let him have one. <laughs> Let him add that. Yeah. I can't have them all. They'd be selfish. Oh, there you go. We just had a brown five back. Hello. There you go, then. That's the long cut. Ah, oh, no. The sneakiest line of defence is down. I don't know how they noticed you there in all that camo. <laughs> yeah. We were just watching them sneak up and you just poking around the corner and taking them and taking them. That's what do though. Shoot and then hide back to go, where's he gone? Oh, where's he here somewhere? <laughs> Crazy Scotsman Museum, isn't it, again? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's that Italian camo, isn't it? Fuck yeah. No, this is a uh, oh, paper free zone. Ah. Well, mate. Well, I'll get together. I think the jacket comes from Italy. Oh, come from Germany. The best comes from Slovenia. The gloves come from fucking somewhere else. <laughs> They're still shooting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> You've just killed a dead man. Zombie. Zombie. <laughs> Bring. Anyone here play 
infected? Yes. yes. Cool. That's what we're going to be playing tonight. We have a crazy Scotsman over by the casino who wants to infect you. The crazy Scotsmans in the village with you are not infected yet. <laughs> they will be. They'll probably be first. When you, basically, when you're shot, you respawn at the casino and you're now infected and your job is to kill everyone in the village. We are all going to die. Oh, he gets aggressive, doesn't he? Yeah, he's just gone that way. Gone I've just right. seen him go across, so he's coming through. There he is. He's just gone straight across again. I know, that's a marshal. He's just going to be launching a lot of pyro. <laughs> There he is. Where is he? Straight through there, he's there back he by the hospital oh, thing. Jordan! Jordan! Oh, is that a marshal? Oh, no. oh, 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 Run away! Find a set of tree alight. Who are you? What are you doing? He's shooting over that. In that situation, just say yes. <laughs> I said yes. Are you alright, mate? Mate, that man got licked the fuck. Are you alright? If you're still alive, make a funny noise. Oh, yeah? Oh, wait, no. No, 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 no. Fuck it. No. We're all dead. It's fair to say that we always have fun over at Airsoft Plantation and today was absolutely no different. It was really good to see everybody having a good laugh and celebrating the input that Gordon has had on the local Airsoft scene. It's going to be different not being able to go into the shop on a Saturday and have a chat for hours upon end getting in the way, occasionally pretending we're actually helping at some point. I want to say a great big thank you from the team for all the help that Gordon has given us over the years and all the help that he'll be giving us going forward. And I want to say a personal thank you from me as well. 
as if I hadn't met Gordon, I never ever would have known that Airsoft even existed. Don't forget, www.battlezoneairsoft.com will still be up and running, so you can still get all of your Airsoft goodies from Gordon. So we wish him the very best of luck on all of his new adventures, and we'll have to travel up to Scotland to uh, test out some of the sites up there. So from us, goodbye, and we'll see you on the next video.